when you put when, when it's something really like, like this, other people are not allowed to touch things until Ashley does first. That's one of the rules. This fucking dude, okay, there's a circle. There's this new cop here in Riley County. She's got brunette hair. She's almost identical, but she just changed her look. But she was almost identical to the suit woman that picked me up at age two in California and took me to Texas. Now, Corey Taylor's dumb is another guy. And then there's a, a blonde haired dude that looks kind of like me, but taller. There's a circle I do not want to be in. I don't know why that cop's here and why she looks like that lady. I told her though, if, I mean, if it, I mean, is she in the FBI or is she just a lookalike or does her family line inherit that or is, is, does she get younger and they're just keeping their same look? I mean, that's uncanny, right? That's weird. This is not looking like me. This ugly face is all swollen. You gotta stop making me look like other people. And Greg Clark better not ever touch my body again with his spirit. You're ugly. I do not want to be with you. I do not want to look like you. You make me look ugly. Mixing with me. Stop it. Ah, uh, okay. Aiden is not supposed to be here, neither is Lucian. I can hear your voices. I have a voice demon. After the voice demon, once it leaves there, it gets sent around to mimicry, then everybody's playing with it. I told you to go the fuck home. So my bone shape when I was 10 years old, look, I'm, I fucking lost weight. I should be 92 pounds now. I lost weight. This is still too much. I should be fucking flat stomached with a fucking tongue of fucking skin on my belly. Whoever the fuck has been fucking stalking me and fucking with me is right around the corner trying to bust up and biff on me. Detective Yeager, I'm scared. I should be able to change my bone shapes at will. When I say this is what I'm shaping to, that's what it goes to. And I purchased myself. And when I asked Mr. Solace and Mrs. Solace in San Antonio, Texas, that will all be like a brother to me. I don't understand because some of these times I should not have been blacked out. When I was in the mental hospital in Texas, you, Mr. were me telling me about this woman who some people are only worth the fuck. And Mrs. Kelly was over here on the right. Okay, I don't know, I wanna get attached to you. You have lots of marriage. I love me. And Daniel and James I gave to my brother, Mr. Solace, Devil Mafia, to take care of. Please don't let me get attached to you that way. I don't wanna be your wife. I do not want these ugly people on my fucking face. They have to stop swelling up my face and making me ugly. They don't need to be smoozing with you. Please do not have your lovely things mixed with me and ruin my body and my shape because I'm a shapeshifter and they don't need to change my jaw and put fat and make me ugly and be jealous of you and your time that you need to spend with them. Please help because I've always made contracts with husbands. They get guilty and if they are to hurt Ashley or her male self, because Ashley's male self may not be her husband. Ashley will be loving herself. But right. so we're trying to have a hard time. This guy with this child, he loves himself. So without the spirits so and without being able to see them, a person's body loves a person's body. And that should be all there is, okay? We're trying to figure this out, but well, there's other people to look at, and when we get married, and marriage is forever is serious. Well, uh, right. But I want to look like me. I want to show me to a person, not somebody else, and I want to be able to have what I purchased is mine. And I need this weight that other people keep putting on me, off of me. I've been trying on this diet for years and someone's poisoning my guts, putting their poo poo in here, making me live off the energy of this demon that doesn't last forever. I will end up dead. Please help me, Mr. and Mrs. Salas, San Antonio, Texas, thank you.